uh, time to wake up and be a responsible teenager now. Huh? Let's learn a little bit about Chloe. Let's get some insight on who this girl is through her room. As soon as oh, brought to you by Square Enix, because we make a lot of Final Fantasies, but also some other things. That's their motto. You can look it up. Graceful, clothed, and on top of the covers. With shoes on. Oh, come on, you're gonna get dirt on the sheets. What are you doing? Some dignity. Uh, never mind. It seems dignity is uh, out the window. The lack of shits being given right now. I can breathe it like right in the air. Oh shit, with the weed on me. This whole story is different. Sometimes, no spoilers. All I want to do is shut my eyes and tell the world to go to hell. Daily rituals are important. Okay. Even when they involve writing unread letters to friends who have forgotten you. Now this is a sad part of the story. She was best friends with her friend Max, who's in the first game. And they get reunited in the in the first game. But in this one, the prequel, Max moves away. And essentially just stops talking to Chloe. So to cope with that, to cope with her best friend leaving when she needed her most, she creates a fake diary of letters to Max because Max wouldn't read the letters anyway. So she's literally talking to no one but expecting, but can't be disappointed because there's no, she's not expecting an answer, but she still needs to cope with that by pretending she's talking to a friend, which is the mo which is actually some, some metal stuff right there. I'm not gonna read through it. You can all read through it if you forget the game, but it's very depressing. All right, can I move? Oh, look. Yeah, let's hey, look Max. At the... Hey, Dad. Oh, that was her Another dad. Another day in paradise. Uh, right? Her dad died in a car accident, and then Max left, so... It says a lot that this photo is the one by her bed. Last night, seeing Firewalk live. The skeevy assholes. That girl. Was that really Rachel Amber? I don't know. You're pretty drunk, so Smell you had like, like a whole beer. Beer. Better change clothes. Yeah, that'll that'll fucking change things. Fun right, fact: so. Shark babies eat their siblings in the womb. <coughs> Sorry, a little Maybe sick. Maybe that's why I'm an only child. Um. Definitely has some attachment to past memories in her childhood with all the fantasy stuff. But we could fix that. No more unicorns, no more princesses, Better. and no more fucking rainbows. Narendam. Words of wisdom don't I wonder if fail the viewers even know what that is yet. Terrible news, my um, hmm. Well, 100% of the shots is so overdone, so I never want to hear that quote ever again. Sorry. Not sorry. Just ask Steve Jobs. Jesus is 1%. Inspiration, 99%. That's not the quote. That's not the quote at all. Dad was so proud of me for winning that stupid science fair. Nice, and it's broken. Someone had a temper tantrum. <laughs> Bask, ye mortals, in the light of the glowy bear. All hail the glowy bear. Report card. Do I even want to look? Man, I am killing it this year. Uh, Somehow, I don't think Mom's going to feel the same way. Well, she's gonna kill something, all right. But if she never finds it, yeah, no one needs to see that. 
Thank you. Foolproof. Improved. With my vast amounts of science knowledge, I will improve this periodic table with an educated Better and sophisticated... Okay, chemistry. you're actually garbage. Um, we could turn off the garbage music. Actually, I kind of liked it. I miss it now that it's gone. Pirate hat, put it on. I bet long Max Silver um, traded her hat for beer and booty long ago. Max is my trigger word. I get all sad every time. I guess we should put some clothes on. Like an adult. Do I have any? Oh, I have choices? Oh, I didn't know I had choices. Well, we just saw Firewalk, so... This choice will have consequences, I'm sure. Now everyone knows I was there. Because who... What's the point of a cool story if no one knows? And I'm sure just changing my shirt will prevent everything else that happened from smelling. Like, I'm sure she won't smell the cigarettes in my pants or shoes or skin because I'm not taking a shower. Okay. Uh, I really should get going. No! More Max procrastination! Max made years ago. And because it was Max, not a single song was pirated. Mm, what a loser. Am I right? As awesome as some of those shows with Elliot were, they were nothing compared I had too much to Red Bull. Firewalk last night. Yeah, because breaking and entering makes things exciting. All right, let's leave. <coughs> Shit. Where's my phone? God, it's Jesus. not here. How drunk was I last night? You had a beer. I said breakfast. Guess I better try calling my phone with moms. Nice. Time to snoop. Okay. That's what this game's all about, Mom's honestly. Mom's phone is probably in her room. Getting other people's I business. I can use it to call mine, then figure out where the hell I left it. Is there anything in here that I could use? Mom's hiding her gray hair to impress her boyfriend. Nice. Maybe Same. gray hair's his kryptonite. Maybe I should dye my hair gray. Wait, can I? Mom's hiding her gray hair to impress her boyfriend. Nope. Oh god, don't say it again. Maybe oh gray god. hair's oh, his echo. kryptonite. Maybe I should dye my hair gray. Alright. Into... is there anything in here? No. What's in here? What do we got under the bed? Show me what you got. Show me what you got. Tiny Rick. It's weird that Mom's always hoarding these old catalogs. It's not like we have any money. It's fun to dream. It's like the lottery. What's in here? Snoop. Sometimes you have to get knocked down lower than you've ever been to stand up what taller than reading? you ever were. Blech. I agree. Don't give up on yourself. A single spark can start a fire that burns the entire prairie. She's so better. enthusiastic. Fire's cool. That's the thought that went through her, her head. Her, her, um, all right, I believe that. Look at the bed, no, there's nothing in the bed. I don't care about the bed. What's in the trash? There's always good stuff in the trash. What's this? Mom's old engagement ring. Grade B? Fuck you, Arcadia Pond. Wait, Mom's selling her engagement ring? Life is tough for Chloe. All right, we just got a little quiet cloud thing, so we opened up some options for conversation. We learned something we weren't supposed to. <coughs> I hate that she hides all our old pictures of Dad. Everything you do in this game will have an effect. Well, not everything, but a lot of stuff. Stuff that you won't even consider, like just doing this. Let's put the picture frame. You don't deserve to be stuck in a drawer like this. On the dresser, because it's not okay to hide from your past. You must accept it and embrace it. And I just like fucking with shit. Let's be honest. I like causing trouble. Now we take the purse. I can't believe I used to sneak in there for her makeup. Wait, wouldn't her phone be in her purse? Why is... Oh, there it is. Oh, wait, hold on. What's in the drawer first? Not done snooping. We're done when I say I'm done. Oh, okay. Ah, Wish I didn't see that. Mom. We're done. Bad enough that we David done. comes here for dinner. No more snooping. It's enough snooping. I'm snooped out. 
All right, Snoop Dogg, call his phone. How can mom look at this every day and not see what a tool she's dating? Just call the phone. What does angst even mean? Hold on. Hold on, I gotta look this up. I've been saying it a lot, I gotta know what it means. A deep feeling of anxiety or dread, typically an unfocused one about the human condition or state of the world in general. So, deep dread. Nice. Oh, Ooh, gotta find the phone, got distracted. Oh, hello, cell phone. You were throwing up at the toilet. There Good we for go. You. Wonder how many calls I've missed. Oh, this part's sad. Learn a little bit more about Chloe's backstory her, the people in her life. Will you be coming up some, some uh, will you join us for supper? No, we'll be coming home at some point. Chloe, there will be consequences. Chloe, breakfast. Bring my purse down with you, please. Jesus. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where's the phone? What's up here? What's this stuff? Are these the people in my life? This is... Her stepdad, or as she says, step douche. This is William, her original dad, who died. Max left, and Frank, her drug dealer. All of the important people in her life. Elliot, who's this guy? Spanish to suck. Lucky if I passed. Ah, oh, lo siento. I don't know what that means. No, I think I did okay. Cool. What are you up to? Okay, so he's got a crush. Finish chem homework? Nope. Dude, that's the third time. I already know everything. I think I Classic saw mom's teenager. purse in her room. I think we literally opened it. You literally click look. Does all that weed go in your head? Come on. Come on, kid. Get your head out of your ass. Take the purse. Oh, can you grab my cell phone too? Oh my gosh. No more dawdling. I need to talk I'll to you. Punch you in the dawdle. Oh. Yeah, that really makes me want to hurry. Can I put the guap in her purse? I would like to put the guap in her purse. Left mouse button. I would like. Oh, Coming, I was clicking the right Mom. mouse button. Fuck you guys. <coughs> Finally, you can put my purse on the dining table. Might still have time for breakfast if you hurry. She seems so enthusiastic. Dining table, here I come. Mm-hmm. Nah. Dining table, put the purse on Chloe, it. Chloe, I don't have all day. Ooh. Would you get over here That's already? That's 300 points for Griffin. I should see what mom wants before she strokes out. News. Wow. Sean Prescott's son, Nathan, goes to my school. Sounds like the apple didn't fall far from the asshole. I'm like 90% sure that's not the motto. Dad's old swear jar. We spent the last of his curses on bus fare and milk. How can bacon smell so good, but mm. I'd still rather stuff these sugar bombs in my mouth? Ooh. Pot roast? Mom hates pot roast. Interesting. It's not that I'm ungrateful. It's just that... When your mom works in a diner, you're not always in the mood for diner-type food. Hmm. That's hey, a lie. Diner you food is the best. Talk? I hate you. Chloe, I'm what sorry. happened that to you? Mean. It's no big deal. I walked into a door. Believable. You good, seem good, to be walking smooth. into a lot of doors lately. Mm-hmm. Is that a metaphor for life? When I send you just a text message, me? Chloe, like last night, I need you to answer. Ugh. You can just say text. You don't have to say message. And I need you to answer without the snark. All right, she's Sorry. not gonna buy. I'm sleeping. I hear you. I'll do better about replying. <coughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Is that what you wanted to talk about? Yeah, we're done. Let's leave. Good. What is it with you and David? Oh my god, no. Always cutting to the oh. chase. Why can't we just have some pleasant conversation before school? Pot roast. I thought you hated pot roast. You can have a no thank you helping. No, you hate pot roast. I don't care. I don't hate it. And David likes it. And don't say you don't care. So that's what we're care. doing now? 
whatever your boyfriend likes. You should be nice to Chloe's stepfather. I might. It depends. We'll see. We'll see. David. You do realize I hate your boyfriend with every fiber of my being, right? Nice. Chloe! You don't hate him. He calls me girly. He's a dickhole. He can be old-fashioned. Oh yeah, God. an old-fashioned dickhole. This girl needs to get slapped in the face. Ah, right. Holy shit. School. My favorite. <coughs> you used to love to learn. Used to. Yeah. I used to think drugs were lame too. She's, she's I wish literally she calling out. Like that. She's not. Someone help her. Oh my gosh. You're Are you selling your engagement ring? Chloe, jewelry gets appraised for all sorts of reasons. Like for insurance. Sure. Nice dodge. Boom. How about this? You don't go in my bedroom when I'm not there. How about you don't ask me to get your damn purse then? Thank you. Let's not fight. I made you breakfast. Well, no. I'm not hungry. I'll just. Grab something later. The, the bacon, though. Uh, oh, you'll bacon. enjoy this. The other day, I made four eggs, two for David, two for me. And just before I served them, he says, what are you going to eat? Huh? <laughs> I'll enjoy that, huh? Firewalk? Is that the band you mentioned last week? I'm still bummed you wouldn't let me go. Mm-hmm. What? <laughs> I know what time you came home last night. And don't think you can get out of school just because you missed the bus again. Why would Never. you assume that? Who do you think your principal calls when you skip? Do you think I enjoy lying for you, saying you're sick just so you don't get expelled? Mom of the year, actually. Between your grades and your disregard for my rules, I see you slipping. Slipping? As in? I'm worried. But mom, Correct. the whole point of lowering expectations is so you won't be disappointed in me. Never again. You're happy wow. doing what you're doing? Fine. Keep at it. Just let me know so I can stop fighting with Blackwell to keep you on scholarship. Money's tight enough as it is. Damn. That was a deep spiritual thing. Maybe David could help. Maybe David should start paying rent. He spends the night often well, enough. How would you know? You're never here yourself. <laughs> Go, I actually keep forgetting so discipline. Chloe goes to David school. David should mind his own business. Yeah, F David. I think it's great David's taking He's an interest. He's a smelly butt. He's a good man. Maybe he can help. Hmm. Let's go. Let's bring back. Ooh, do we go to the past or we go to the present? Let's go to the past. She wants to avoid it. We gotta bring it to her face. Dad was a good man. That's not fair. I'm glad. Your father still has a place in your heart. But sometimes we need to make more room in our hearts for new people. And no. sometimes, when we're incredibly Never. desperate and lonely, we choose the absolute wrong kind of people to let into our hearts. Mom. David's had some hard times too, you know. Yeah, that's a fair point. If he's kind enough to share his experience, I expect you to listen. <laughs> like I'd let him get within 15 feet of me. Boom. You're being unreasonable, actually. When he takes you <laughs> to school today. Oh, shit. Very no, that's funny. Awkward. You will be nice. You will be respectful. And you will say thank you. Are you serious? This is such... What, Chloe? Such what? <sighs> such Mom's spaghetti. Trying, I guess. Maybe I should, too. But what's the point in getting along if it means pretending everything's fine when it's not? Be understanding. Say what you feel. Well. Hmm. See, I already clicked this answer, but I need to click it again. Kill David and take his power as your own. That's exactly what I was thinking. Say what I feel. Good idea, Bob. You here. want me to pretend I'm okay with David? <coughs> that everything's okay? I'm not. He's a chauvinistic piece of shit, frankly. Chloe, and if your father could hear you. No, uh, that's you're right. A tough shot. I'm sure Dad and the mustache would get along great. It's a big bed. There's room enough for all three of you. She's classy. That's enough. 
All I'm asking for is a little respect. Why is that it's too much? Way too much, dude. You're being unreasonable. I love you, Chloe. I miss you. Nobody could have replaced her father. I did the best I could. Mom. That's the best you could. I don't know where I lost you. Oh. Oh, now you it's didn't past. Lose me. Now it's past. Right. It took this conversation. David's waiting. This He'll is one conversation. Keys. They're in that ashtray you made me. Go be his problem now. Oh, nice. Bringing David his keys is about the most humiliating thing Mom could ask me to do. Ooh, here we go. This is what I wanted. Consequences. You're welcome. She won't notice that, I'm sure. Where did you get three? We're already supporting one. Thanks. Where did you get the money? I found it. Family pick used to hang here. I Wow. I can't actually remember which one. That's sad actually. Is that a Max? Aren't you glad you oh, left for Seattle, sad. Max? Huh. <sighs> and never looked back? Damn. Trophy. Plant. Ashtray. Here they are. Keys. Take the keys. Stop looking at the ashtray. You know. Let's get these to David so he can... No point in putting off the inevitable torture of driving to school with David. I feel like Chloe going. is being kind of a bitch here at Max. It's not like she chose to. She didn't, but hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me show you something here. Let me let me show you this. I'm going to show you this right here. Bopinier, this is what's going to make you change your mind, all right? We're going to start from the top, and this is where it gets said. She would moved at this point, and her first message is, So sorry I've been bad about emailing. Texting is better for me anyway. Yo, it's Max. How's it going? You there? And then, 12, no, sorry, nine days later, nine days, gah, sorry, I've been really busy. You'd love Seattle, more in a bit. She immediately responds, immediately. Maybe some hitchhiking in my future. And then, like, another 14 days later, hey, hippie. And the next day, I'm so sorry, maybe we should set up a time to call. What is this, a job interview? She's still understanding, no worries. I'll check my dance card. It's 7 p.m. in Arcadia Bay. What is it in Seattle? 20, wait, what is it? 2019 in Seattle? I know, right? Maybe this weekend. Sure, anytime. Let me know. Yo, Queen of Crickets. That's 14 days later. What's the latest? And then a month later almost. Max! Nothing! Ah! It's so fucked up. I'm sorry, it's fucked up. Look at this guy. Oh, 420, nice. Look at that, look at that. I feel bad for Chloe, but I also think Max isn't as much at fault as Chloe makes it out to be. I don't know, I just think it sucks, man. I gotta disagree on that one. I gotta disagree. I just feel that like they were best friends. This is a person you grew up with. And they're not in your life after like they moved to Seattle. I'm just asking for a text. I'm not saying she's gotta like be there for you 24/7 after that, but like that hurts. That hurts a little bit. I moved from Brooklyn. I feel this. I get it, man. I moved from Brooklyn, Long Island. Same shit. Hey, is this Chloe? It's Steph Gringrich. Hey, I have your DVD. Can you get it before school? Thanks. Riveting conversation. Love to have it again. And we out. Probably could have gotten more mischief, but Snoop Dogg is out of there. No more snooping. What a piece of crap. Nice. The car, too. Ha! Snarky. Why do you women always take forever to get ready? Oh, a good We're start. We're you men will leave without us. Nice. High-waisted jeans. That's my favorite. Oh, I'm a, no, I'm Mom. a dog. No, Mom. I swear he beat himself to death with a tire iron. <sighs> Repeatedly. A, sna a nice snapping point. So much respect. Chloe, is that a black eye? No. no. Insubordination. 
No wonder your mother's worried about you. Oh, that's sweet. Yo, Jay Stern, when what's up? Age, I got good to hear you doing sure good, scraps. dude. But it's not responsible. Glad to have you back on the stream, you dude. You owe it to your mother to do better. Tell me again what I owe my mother, dirtbag. Mm hmm. Help us with some oh, fine decision making. Probably cracked. You know what a spark plug does? Yes. It ignites. Did you not hear me? I said I know what it does. Boom. That's fair. Like I don't know why I socket it. wrench set from the garage, and we can get moving. You have a giant scar. That's pretty awesome. What is this? Quality time? Ugh. I mean, where is it? Better just get the socket wrench and get this over with. You a pirate? What's David doing, leaving stuff in our garage anyway? Does he think he's moving in or something? Yes, he's moved in. He's, dude, he's here. I think you're in denial or something. Let's open this shit up. But dim. Get the thing. Bring 50, it to 50 David. 50-50 chance I smash him in the face Play with this. Play nice. 60-40. Maybe 90-10. Those odds are getting... Did she just tell me the odds? Side of my head. It's in the shape shape of a mood. Wait, I don't know. I don't understand what that means. Maybe I'm just being ignorant. Of course you remember to write it. I put my graffiti. I don't get my, my mark on special everything. treatment. What message does David Do really mean need to hear? Box of dicks. Got it. Classy. At least he'll know. He'll know who wrote it. Oh, good graphic too. Type of, gotcha, gotcha. Nice, here we go, here we go. I wanna fill this up. I wanna be perfect square. Fire extinguisher. I'm sure she's gonna say some snarky stuff about him. But how about we just get to Oh, hold on, this is important. This is Dad's important. Dad's toolbox. He used to get so excited it's whenever Dad's anything toolbox. sprung a leak or busted. Muscle car, here we go. Take me to school. Fucko. Just give him the socket wrench. I don't even want to talk a to this guy. More hustle wouldn't have killed you. Nice. That makes me feel real good. Ooh, too slow. Cut. Cut. Awkward silence. Just stare into his eyes. See what's gunking up the works there? That's a sign of carbon, carbon deposits. Deposit. No shit. You know. You could actually be good at this if you lost the attitude. Nice. My attitude is what makes me special, David. That's true. I actually agree All with right. that. She's pretty snarky. It's like a talent. It's like they have writers. This is angst, though. This is some deep depression and despair. He was kind of a dick the whole time, but he gave me a backhanded compliment, so... Fine. Whatever. The lightest of fit fist bumps. <laughs> Begrudgingly fist bumps. Oh, my... Hey, you're taking those tools with you, right? Every house needs a good toolbox. And I regret it. <sighs> We've See? already got one, but thanks. <laughs> wow, like he just mocked. Like that's hmm. Hmm. This is why I wanna like tell him off in the car. Like mm. Ready to roll. Oh, I just wanna... Please don't want to talk. Please don't want to talk. I wanna Please... talk to you about something. There it Fuck. is. <laughs> we don't have to like each other. That's but true. you will respect me. That's not true. You've enjoyed enough of a vacation from having a father figure. So there's oh, some that's a things I want to be real clear about. I'll be nice. I'll mm -hmm. be nice. Joyce, your mother, she's hurting, Chloe. Hurting for you. You've had it rough. No doubt about it. Okay. But all this staying out late, ignoring her command drinking drug use 
it's making everything harder for her. Yes, some good points. You need to shape up, get your act together, hey. and put someone else first for a damn change. Am I making myself clear? Is it crazy if part of what David's saying makes sense to me? <sighs> That'll be nice. Got it. Thanks. We should really get going. Whoop. Glad we understand. Hold on. Yeah. Joey Stern just got automated for saying, "Wait, so let me get this straight. Automod, fuck went through, but Country bitch got censored." You sick? What? Good job, Automod. You really? Oh, hold on. Flashback. Yeah, I love this song. Where are we? What's going on? I just called to tell you. Those of you that have not seen Bo Burnham, this is a good example of Bo Burnham, and you should go watch. He's a comedian, he makes fun of country what music. What a beautiful day! And yes, country music is worth making fun of. Does. Yeah. This, this isn't right. That's weird. Okay, the table. Oh, this is freaky. Dad, turn it up. that it's freaky it's freaky every time <coughs> this makes me feel bad man 